What's going on, people? Troops TV, back again. Back up, Blood Clark again, you understand? Match reaction time, you get me. Premier League action, back in our lives, Blood, before that dead and boring, dusty international break enters our lives and get our lives again. It's ridiculous, bro, you get me? We've literally just started the football back in August and we're already on our second international break. And we're going to get a third one in November as well, Blood, you get me? But... We did end this international break with a victory, blood. You understand? The last one we went into, we went into it with a 1-1 draw against Brighton. This one, we're going in with a victory. Bit of confidence for the lads when they go away with their international teams. Arsenal, three. Southampton, one. Now, the Aaron Ramsdale and friends derby ends in an Arsenal victory. You understand? Um, first things first, the lineup, blood. The starting eleven was very... Peculiar blood. You understand? It was a very Bando esque starting 11. It's the maddest starting 11 I've probably seen from an Arsenal team since maybe lockdown. You understand? Or um, just before we um, exited lockdown. You get me? Um, Partey at right back. You understand? I feared for the worst. We saw when Arteta tried to play him at right back in previous seasons how left it went. But today, it went nothing but completely right, bro. You understand? Partey was arguably our best defender today, blood. You get me? He was better than Saliba. He was better than Gabriel. And he was the better performing fullback. You get me? Calafuri. I'm really liking Calafuri going forward. He's got a lot to offer, but decision-making needs to improve for me, blood. You get me? He's very passionate. You understand? And I love that. Carl, you, know, you don't know me. Very passionate. Love my passionate people. You know, the Italians, very, very passionate. But I think he's a bit, I think he's a bit overzealous in the challenge, blood. You get me? I think he overcommits a little bit too much. I think he needs to look at Timber and just see how cool, cool, calm and collective Timber is. But Calafuri making himself at home. Very happy with him. Kai, blood clot, Havertz, blood. Killer, blood clot, Kai. Now, this man is just... It's crazy, bro. I'm not going to lie, blood. Because when we signed him last season, I was like, nope, this is the wrong move. 65 million absolute catastrophe when we could use that money elsewhere but after the shaky start he had when he joined the club he has really been one of our better performing players blood you get me today when Southampton took the lead it was Kai that was taking the game by the scruff of the neck he was the one trying to get involved he was the one playing like a leader he was the one trying to make things happen blood that shot that goal today doesn't happen two years ago you get me the confidence he has now as an Arsenal player it's through the roof, blood. You get me? I keep saying that when I chat to these Chelsea idiots and these dickheads on my, on, on the Back Again podcast, make sure you tune in on Monday, 1.30 p.m., cheeky blood. When I chat to Flawless and, and, and Lewis and these dickheads and, and, and they're just, they got their goggles on, they, they, they have us agenda, you get me? I, I, I was in that camp, bro. I tell them that this is not Chelsea Havertz, bro. This is more like Leverkusen Havertz, blood. Same way that Chelsea have not signed Man United Sancho, we have not signed Chelsea Havertz, blood. United signed Chelsea Mount. But us and Chelsea, it looks like it's going to work out for us. You get me? Because Kida Blood Clark Kai, another important goal for him. But Kyle Blood Clark Saka, they keep doubting him. They keep making comparisons. This player's better. That player's better. Saka's boring. Saka's overrated. Saka can't do this. Saka can't do that. Well, one thing Saka can do is get assists in every game, bro. You get me? Every Blood Clark game. Two goals and an assist today. Deserved the goal. The ball he gave for Martinelli. Absolute mesmerising ball. Going on to Gabby Ross Clark Martinelli. Gabby Blood Clark Martinelli. Man, try to doubt my boy. Who's doubting now, blood? Hmm? Quiet in the courtroom, innit, blood? You understand? Three, let me, what's that? Three goals, two assists. You know what I mean? Hitting form. You get me? Looking more confident. You understand? Did I not say? Sort out the left-hand side. Martinelli will come back to life. Look what's happening now, blood. You get me? Marino came off the bench. Very good. Looks very good, blood. Can get the ball down and move it. He's aggressive. You know what I mean? Looking forward to see him play more as well. But you get me. Going 1-0 down today was all about coming back and getting the win. We did that. We move on um, to the international break now. You get me? Hopefully, everyone comes back safe and sound. We saw what happened last time with Odegaard. So, you get me? Arsenal, Arsenal fans, get them prayers going, blood. You understand? But you lot know the vibes. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts of the game in the comments below. It's your boy Troops. Enjoy the international break. And I'm out.